Josh here over at Essencia Farm, and I want to give you guys some tips on how to know when a watermelon is ready. So over at Essencia Farm, uh, this is one of our watermelon rows. Uh, this variety is called Black Diamond, and it gets quite large. Uh, these watermelons can get 30 up to 50 pounds, um, and when they get that large, you don't get a bunch of them, but it's very important that you harvest them at the right time. So I'm going to show you a watermelon that we have currently. And this guy is probably uh, 20 pounds or so. Definitely not quite ready, but there's a couple things um, that you can look at when you're trying to decide if it's ready. So one of the most common ones is by thumping the watermelon, you can get a gauge of the sound. If it's got like a high ping to it, it's not quite ready. If it's got like a deep thud or almost a hollow sound, that's a really good sign that it's getting ready. Uh, another tip that farmers like to use is uh, finding the tendril. So if you look closely at the main stem, uh, the main stem goes across and then the watermelon comes down and directly opposite of the watermelon is a tendril. So this tendril uh, will attach to different things, uh, but over time as the watermelon's ripening, this tendril will actually die back. So we'll start at the top and it'll die all the way back to the uh, main stem and and once it's completely brown that's a good sign that you know the watermelon is ready another tip that you can use is checking the field spot so the field spot is where the watermelon rests on the ground um, because it's not exposed to the sunlight it'll generally start as a white color um, but as the watermelon uh, matures that white color will turn into kind of a creamy yellow color. Uh, once you see that creamy yellow color, that's you know that's a good sign that your watermelon's probably ready. So I like to use all of those tips um, as a, a really good way to make sure that the watermelon's ready. So if you're growing any watermelons in your home garden this season, uh, give those tips a try and let me know how it goes. Thanks.